Welcome to the fourth and final video of Section 6 of Creating Reports with SQL Server 2012 Reporting Services. Upon completing this video, you will know how to deploy the drill-through reports to the report server. For drill-through reports, both the parent and the child report must be deployed to the report server for proper operation. We will start by deploying the child report named Product Details to the report server. Let's go to the Solution Explorer window. We will right-click on the Product Details report and select Deploy. We can monitor the deployment progress in the Visual Studio output window. The output window can be displayed by pressing Ctrl, Alt, and the letter O simultaneously. Once we see that the report has deployed successfully, we'll be ready to deploy the parent report, Report Parameter Example. Remember that the deployment project settings are on the Projects Properties page and are accessed by selecting Project from the Visual Studio menu and then selecting Properties. The report server URL is different than the report manager URL. Think of the report server as a web service that handles report metadata, while the report manager is used to view the report. Your database administrator can supply you with the report manager URL. Next, we will deploy the parent report by right-clicking on our report parameter example report and selecting Deploy. Once again, we will monitor the deployment progress in the Visual Studio output window. Now we will use Internet Explorer to go to the Report Manager. We see our Data Sources folder and Report Project 1 folders. Let's click on the Report Project 1 folder. We can see the Parent Report and the Child Report. Let's click on the Parent Report to have it displayed. Next, let's click on a product name to have the details of that product displayed. This confirms to us that both of our reports have been deployed successfully. In summary, both the parent and the child reports have to be deployed to the report server for them to properly operate. Once the reports are deployed, the drill-through reports should behave the same in the report manager as they do in Visual Studio. The project's property page in Visual Studio is where the deployment settings are specified.